Hi, today I'm going to be taking a look at the vintage V6 M24 down here at Groove Studios. And I uh, just want to tell you a little bit about this guitar. Uh, last year when I went up to John Holmes Skews, they actually had this guitar as a prototype and I was so impressed with it. I said, when you make these, I actually want one. Um, but they actually sent me two, so that's pretty cool and I'm really grateful for that. But let me tell you a little bit about the guitar. Um, it's a really interesting looking guitar. They come in a range of striking colors. This is actually Ventura Green. The one that I've got here is Laguna Blue, apparently. And they also do a yellow one, which I can never remember the name of. Um, but they're all very sort of um, harking back to the kind of 80s shred kind of uh, music scene. So uh, you definitely stand out if you play one of these. Um, but the body itself is an American older body. Uh, it's got a bolt on 24 fret uh, maple neck and maple fingerboard. Uh, the frets I think are 24 um, medium jumbo frets and it's really cool the guitar itself has a contoured low profile uh, neck and heel joint so it's really easy to get high up on the guitar and very comfortable to play. Um, other important things about the guitar are that it has a Wilkinson uh, V50 uh, 2k I think it is vibrato but it's very bouncy uh, gives you all the dive bombable and flickability kind of things that you want from a guitar it's also got Wilkinson easy lock tuners which help keep it in tune after you've been doing all that kind of dive bombing um, pickups we've got two Wilkinson um, humbuckers which are really great they clean up really well quite medium output I'd have said um, so you've got a tight bottom end really crisp highs and sort of crystal shimmery cleans obviously two humbuckers controlled by the three-way toggle switch so you've got the bridge two pickups and neck and also here you've got the volume and a tone control okay so that's a little bit about the guitar and let's take a closer look we'll start off with some clean sounds and I'm going to start off using the neck pickup Okay, now I'm going to play the neck and the bridge pick up together. Let's see how that sounds. So you've got a really good range of tones that you'd expect from a twin hum humbucking guitar. Uh, the thing I like about this is when you have it in the middle position you get that kind of funky sound. One of the other things that I noticed about this guitar when I first got it out of the box and actually another guitarist who's a friend of mine commented upon this is that it's really resonant um, if I just play a chord when the guitar is unplugged it really rings and uh, it's a great great feeling guitar to play so uh, let's have a look at some of the overdrive sounds and uh, just quickly go through those so starting off with a little bit of the bridge kind of stuff. So that's the bridge pickup. Okay, I'm gonna put it into the bridge and neck together, see what that sounds like. Okay, I'm just gonna roll the volume back a little bit. Let's see how that sounds. So 
so you can hear it kind of keeps its tightness but sort of the tops come through as well so it's a, it's a great little uh, guitar for me is that and here's the neck pickle <laughs> So, if you like this guitar, hopefully as much as I do, I'm going to say I'm really impressed with it. Um, you need to check these out by visiting the JHS or Vintage website. Google it, you'll find that. Um, apart from the build quality and the sounds that you can get from this guitar, the most amazing thing for me, and it, I don't know how they do it, just with the hardware alone, is that these guitars retail for under £250. So that's obviously going to make people smile and uh, I'm sure that these will sell very quickly. So get down to your local music store or check out online and search for the uh, vintage V6 24, M24 and uh, get your hands on one. Thanks very much for listening.